I do cancer-based imaging research, especially for understanding images. We are basically developing uh, very important tools, imaging tools, uh, for preventive cancer detection, early cancer detection in multiple disease, and also we are deriving or developing new imaging biomarkers, which we more precise than before. So it can indicate uh, how well the drug works or the treatment works or not for the cancer. We have uh, tons of images, but they were mostly not uh, annotated. And also we have huge volume of medical images. I think deep learning enables us to do things in a new perspective, and we can achieve much better performance than before. I hope that will bridging the gap that can really help the people in the real world. We have actually more than maybe more than 20 uh, GPU cards. Uh, you know, some of them were donated by uh, Amelia. Uh, we have four range of uh, hardware uh, GPUs like K40, Titan Z, Titan X, and uh, we mostly using Cafe, um, which is on top of the CUDA, and uh, we also uh, use Torch a little bit. Say they try a, a treatment or drug, they they want to know as early as possible whether it works or not. So one of the imaging biomarkers is uh, the lymph node volume. It cannot be done efficiently, cannot be done uh, effectively using the traditional computer vision and medical immunanalysis techniques. And from our recent work, we actually can detect in large lymph node much higher performance than before, and uh, we can measure the lymph node volume very accurately. And we're definitely working on several very important diseases, like. Uh, uh, pancreatic tumor and polyp detection, like colon cancer, and uh, lung disease, uh, and also we are working on exciting new technologies. We can really learning from hospital scale of dataset. That means, like, uh, say, 800,000 patients that has never been done before. So you know, it matters because um, we are actually combating uh, cancer using uh, deep learning technologies.